Hello, hello everyone, welcome back. We're confronted by a big group of uh, pirates, sea raiders. So let's jump in straight there and see how we can fare with these guys. So here we are. And yeah, I'll update you on what happened in the meantime as well. A few things happened. We had Christmas here in Bannerlord Online, which was pretty cute. And I got some presents as well, I'll show you in a minute. But let's first deal with these uh, bandits. I also got uh, Sturgeons, Hyatt. I I'm in Sturgeon right now. We have Cavalry as well. I'm going to ask him actually to follow me. So I'm upgraded. That's the first ever Cavalry unit we have. And uh, yeah, we're going to now see. It's uh, the biggest ever uh, Sea Raider party. Biggest ever I've encountered. So let's see how we're going to do with it. I swapped my bow and arrow for a throwing weapon. Harpoon, uh, also acquired from one of these rascals. I also got a nice little helmet from them. And uh, yeah, yeah, you see this nasal helmet, right? In fact, let's ask. Charge. <coughs> oh, par pardon me. Let's ask our infantry to charge. Yeah, let's charge our uh, cavalry. I hope he's uh, following me. Yes, he is. Okay, that's great. Now, this is the first. The biggest probably I've ever encountered in terms of numbers, in terms of raiders numbers, and look how many of them here. Uh, huge, huge army, so I think I'm gonna come out of this with some losses inevitably, but we'll see, we should be able to overcome them, even if it's uh, at a higher price. There you go. Let's see. Yeah, they're doing great though, and my man doing okay. I don't have anything spectacular here, I have... Uh, oh! <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me, okay. So we got a lot of money. 5,000 and a half, almost a lot of experience of various sorts, which is good to see as well. Let's see. Oh, belt. Yeah, this I already have. Uh, belt and everything else. So I'm going to put it all in my inventory. Yeah, won this. Apparently, in one of my previous episodes, I think in the last one, you will see me going around and wandering at those Christmas trees. So what those Christmas trees have, in fact, a present. So I've got this as a present and there was something else. This I won in a battle. Uh, so yeah, and my previous one, I've given it to uh, my uh, decorated male shirt, to one of my companions, I gave him my helmet as well. So I've got this and I have uh, also as a present this Christmas hat. <laughs> so it was too late, uh, you know, when I discovered it. And uh, yeah, it was a bit too late. Oh, what happened? Oh, we were attacked by uh, while I was still, uh, yeah, uh, talking nonsense. We were attacked. Anyway, so yeah. I was uh, wandering around towns and I saw some people going to the Christmas tree and receiving those presents like, you know, doing something, clearly doing something there. I didn't realize what they were doing until a bit too late. But hey, hey, yeah, better late than never. So got myself this present. New shirt. There you go. And also, yeah, my army is going from strength to strength. Uh, yeah, as you can see, doing all right. But... These looters, I wish they would be a little bit brighter, but they attack you nevertheless if, if they're... Actually, let's ask everyone to charge. Yeah, just charge everyone. Yeah, if their strength is somewhat equals yours, they will attack you. Regardless of actual your qualitative uh, superiority, they still attack you and bother you in such a manner. But that's okay, that's okay, not a problem at all. Yeah, so we have some Sturgeons again here, we have some Batanians. Polearm throwing has been improved, that's fantastic. Let's see. So yeah, the best way for me to make money now, I'm just going around hunting this. Uh, looters I'm trying to avoid, they are pretty useless. Pretty useless. Um, so let's go to this town here. So yeah, unfortunately Christmas is over. Christmas is finished. Ah uh, no, there's too many, too many parties here. Let's go, let's go back. Christmas is finished, I only managed to get to one Christmas tree and get one set of presents. But if you could travel around the map, guys, you travel around the map, and go to Christmas trees. They were in several towns. I've seen them, but I've never approached them because I thought, hey, until I got back to Zionica. And then I see some people going, dismounting next to them and doing something dodgy. <laughs> so I, I followed the procedure. And yeah, as a result of that, I uh, got myself this reinforced uh, tabard of a male. So which is a fantastic addition because you remember, we don't buy anything. We have everything we have on us is from the loot, comes from the loot. So and that a very very attractive helmet um yeah it's also what was dropped by the sea raiders oh here's another party of forest bandits i think it's relatively easy to tackle this one let's go attack them before we get to tial 
see if we can sell all that loot oh we can upgrade some men and in fact we can upgrade a whole lot of them let's do that is there anything i can oh yes i can let's go can we go more charmy is that gonna stick last time i tried it did not really work let's see if it worked now no it doesn't okay so we'll need to go for something else let's go for intelligence well we run deep into kuze territory now it seems oh that's interesting i've never been here actually right let's attack these guys how do you actually point an attack direction or whatever it was the next a la a last patch came out i'm not sure let's see where are they so they're supposed to be are you supposed to like how is that supposed to work i'm not sure uh if you know in the comments is it f one of the f buttons or what is happening here actually guys let's charge up everyone yeah let's go yeah not too sure yeah this is this are what are they forest bandits here yeah, you want to close in with them as soon as you can because they are nasty with their arrows and bows and all that there you go get that yeah but we will be uh, yeah it won't be much of a problem for us now with this army oh <laughs> still managed to cut me come here oh there's a tree and he blocked me oh, excellent but to no avail to no avail skill tactics improved got some money as well excellent let's see oh this could be used actually by one of the companions we'll deal with that in a minute right let's go to one of their towns then this is a baltakhan is nearby so let's go and figure out what's going on here i've never been here in fact you know what i might do i might hang around here a little bit see if i can maybe come across any of this desert or whatever they called desert step bandits step bandits there they have horses if I could get some horses, I could finally give my men proper mount, proper mounts. They are already count as cavalry, the, the um, companions for some reason. And then we can actually yeah, create a more powerful uh, party. I was even thinking that entirely recruiting the Kuzates and mounted men and, you know, just sticking with that, sticking with that. And oh, how is this guy doing? Oh, he's doing OK. I think he should be OK. Um, yeah, sticking with them all mounted force oh he managed to defeat all of them did he oh well done and his speed look the speed is of five i guess they're all mounted his guys so yeah had i know had i had i known about these christmas trees i would have gone everywhere because i came oh look at that i've came ac hey where are you going oh they've been already hired ah that's unfortunate i wanted mounted man yeah had, had i known i would have gone to more towns more places you know looking for the trees and the presents they give you i think you were able to take two two presents now footmen no 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 we're not here for footmen obviously this is the wrong place for that uh oh here is a whole gang of them tribal warriors sure yay we now have some cavalry for the first time like ever in uh, big numbers yeah I, I upgraded one of the sturgeons to them but that was about it right let's see where is this guy with the oh before we find him let's see what we have let's see what we have now we don't want that we don't want any of that well uh, this is i'm keeping just in case it started to actually show some prices too this i already have let's see if our companions can be upgraded yeah there you go my man enjoy and uh, what else we can give you this is uh, already there oh yes belt pelt bear pelt there you go uh that is fantastic so they're gonna become real beasts very very soon i fear well i don't fear it i actually desire it and yeah, that's where it's all headed so my companions here going from strength to strength let's see what else we can equip there mm -hmm. so this at all uh well equipped right he's already got all of that aha there wolf pelt cape there you are that is much better looking much much better on you and last last one there you go that's better boots for you as well so he needs a pelt as well and then he'll be all good uh, to go let's have a look at the civilian clothing as well if you can equip anything before giving it away so they all uniformly have a villager leather tunic uh, yeah and scarf in this regard they're actually okay yeah they're actually fine so yeah there's not much i can do for them for my men 
Uh, oh, let's give you this. This is lighter version of what you have in. Yeah, the rest is all fine. All fine, fine, fine. I just need to get this guy, get rid of this scarf, and get him one of these hoods, and he should be golden as well. Okay, th that's that. Now, where is this gentleman artisan? Let's go and sell all of that loot here. So, yeah, it was a really, really good addition to the game. I never realized there were, you know, these pre uh, Christmas giveaways. That was really, really cool. And, yeah, look at this hat, huh? What can equal that? <laughs> All right, let's go. That and yeah, they're making decent money here as well. I tried to sell this. Apparently, you need a trading license to be able to sell this, but I don't know if it's worth it. You know, buying a license, and I don't know how much that will go for. Um, let's see what my party is made of. Oh, I, yeah, I still have some more room is, is, is in this party as well. So these guys are, yeah, they are mounted archers. That is good. Uh, Actually, what do they have in terms of stats, I wonder? Uh, throwing, riding, 40. Ah, that's a problem because of the new patch. You know, where riding was capped. If you have less than 100 riding, then pretty much your horse riding is useless. Uh, you can't do anything in terms of aiming. But that's okay, we can probably upgrade them. And uh, yeah, and then take it from there. Let's see if there's any, any other warriors here around the settlement. Any mounted ones I want. Oh, and actually, before we leave, we need to probably buy, buy some bread. Yeah, let's buy some bread. We only have, yeah, critical amount. We need more, more bread because we don't, we don't want to be starving. Let's see if he's got some bread, actually, if I'm lucky. One of the traders I approached, he didn't actually have any, um, any bread or any food at all. Ah, he, this one does. Okay, great. Let's see. Yes, there is bread. Not the cheapest bread in the world. Still don't know what this is. I need to start looking at the Discord and forums and just, you know, figuring out the rules and bits and bobs. I'm just going around poking everywhere, you know, intuitively learning. Uh, you know, from what I see, from my experience, didn't do any research. So if you have any advice, please leave it in the comments below. Will be, will be much, much appreciated. Oh, here is a band there. Here is a gang, a gangy gang. Let's go and see how many of them. Four of them. Oof. Yay. Gents, how you doing? Tribal warriors. Yeah, all of you, in you go. Let's go, I'll make made out of you superb horse archers. You're gonna be, gonna be lethal. Right, let's see. Oh yeah, we still have room. Wow, we have plenty of room. Okay, let's, let's travel down the step. Let's travel down the step, let's see. What can we, let's go to this place. Maybe there are some, I'm hoping for step bandits and the like. Our speed isn't great, so we might have a bit of a problem catching up with them. But, oh, what is that? clan clan and battle between have stopped at a peace agreement ah okay yeah the usual yeah so maybe maybe there are some horses could be purchased here i believe oh no you cannot interact with those villages can you i don't think you can but the, the patch in the last like a week or so it's going from strength to, uh, to strength the game the bandlord online they keep introducing new features porting features from the patches uh, you know all of that stuff so it's been doing great you can see now when you talk to the um, artisan or whatever its name uh, yeah you can see the prices of the goods as well you used to you couldn't see that uh, you know it, w it wasn't there it is there now so yeah the game constantly constantly seems to be improving the guys are working on it and um, so yeah there is a definite progress do you know what it's super quiet here i don't know there's nothing going on it seems i don't see any even looters are not here i wonder i wonder what's going on if it's also like a, as oh no there 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 some okay but i don't need looters i need something more serious look they're quite speedy as well uh, let's go to this place let's see i have a few more spots maybe i can hire a few more horsemen before we get out of here oh no we're not going there we're going here first right now we're going to train our newly acquired horse archers on these sea raiders uh, yeah, that should be interesting. Let's see. Yeah, companions as well. I already have five. You cannot have more than five companions in your party. I was, I kept freeing them, and I thought, oh, I don't have the spots, uh, the slots here, free slots in my party. But actually, I did have, and it's just a matter of, you know, five is a limit. There was a message actually telling you, can't have any more. You had enough. You need to stop, uh, which is fine. Right. Are we, 
Are we actually gaining on them or are they outrunning us? What's their speed? There's a whole bunch of them here now. No, we should be, should be, should be doing all right. Hopefully. They're taking us out of Kuzate territory though, it seems. Let's see, almost there. There you go. Okay, yeah. Let's, let's go. Let's test those horse archers. Actually, I wonder if I could assign my uh, companions to category as well. Right, horse archers, could you guys come this way? Yeah, there you go. In fact, my other one could also be qualified as a horse archer. Horse archers, charge guys. And you guys charge as well. This They all skirmishes anyway. And uh, infantry, let's bring you closer here. Yeah, there you go. So I'm just becoming more of a kind of a commander style. Uh, entity here rather than a warrior with so many troops now to manage uh, so I'm gonna just do that just gonna do managing more and more uh, as seems as it should be right let's actu actually ask infantry to attack I don't want any of my horse archers killed yeah attack them attack and help out yeah, let's just dive in as well ah no not quite how we doing here boys how we doing we're doing great it seems i just don't want don't to lose cavalry you know cavalry is precious because they are hard to come by especially you know i'm not often here this is the first time i came to this territory it seems there are some reinforcements come okay infantry in you go just charge them horse archers archers uh, archers actually yeah archers you can actually come closer here perhaps and i'm gonna help my infantry a little bit there you go right i uh, can't can't tell who's who but we have done it lazif oh lazif we need to check out how lazif is doing actually i think it was lazif that was about to be upgraded there was a quest for him scarfy scarf not much that was unfortunate sorry mate no more uh, room allowed for you uh that's unfortunate Right, let's see this quest. How many he killed? Oh, he needs to kill another three. Oh, and we have a crush. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave this here on this crush. So stay tuned, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.